Hello, guys. Hi. Nice to Welcome meet you. Welcome to Angus Barrett. Sarah. <laughs> Angus. Lovely to meet you both. It smells amazing in here. I love the smell of leather. Angus makes top quality Australian handmade leather goods with the help of his wife, Sarah. It started as a hobby 30 years ago and gradually became a career. And it's been a ringing success thanks to his passion for quality craftsmanship. What do you think you've brought to the business? Um, I hope that I've brought um, a sort of a, a different, fresh angle. Um, I've surprised myself by the creative work that we've done together. It's been really a pleasure, actually, yeah. So show me around. All right. So is this where it all began with belts for you? I started making bridles and breastplates and I've just got a bit of a thing with horses. I love horses, I love being around horses. And so I've always made my own tack and that's, that's what we sell predominantly is tack. What is tack? The predominant part of tack is the bridle. Wow. The breastplate, yeah. It's just a work of art. Look, the stitching is so beautiful. I love little western swirls. You line the leather so it can't rub. So you learn those sort of things through experience. And, and what does this sort of craftsmanship cost? From around $140 to $385, depending on the type of bridle. I noticed in your logo, designed to work, made to last. That's huge for you, isn't it? Well, that's what we do. We design it so it works. It has to be practical, first and foremost. And then we have to make it to last. I'm actually needing a belt. I didn't wear a belt today, so oh, I was kind of hoping that I would right find place. a belt, but maybe we could make a belt. Yeah? Yeah? If you want it. I hope you're not a hard teacher. No. I know you're fussy. So to make a belt, we've got to go to Angus's factory on the outskirts of town. I always thought leather was quite supple and soft, so it actually comes like this. Look at that. It's Different like a piece type. of plywood. This is, yeah. From this hide, the outline shape of the belt is cut, and then the real work begins. First, we split the belt. That gets it to the right thickness. It's amazing. What's next? Edging. This is where, this is where we get up close and personal okay. now. That's this is a an nice edging tool. tool. It has one angle uh -huh. and one angle only, yep. which is a sweet spot. And what you have to do, hopefully follow along with your fingers. Edging is simply removing the hard edge, giving it a nice soft one. How am I doing? <laughs> You're doing really well, especially on the underside of the belt. <laughs> <laughs> Highly recommend. Okay, <laughs> all right. And to get this nice. edge super right. smooth, Angus runs it through his homemade slicking machine. And then you got to go again. One. That's the lip test. I'm not doing it on my lips. You got to test it. Is it oh, smooth? It's sticky. Well, I'm not going to put it on my lips to test. It feels smooth. I thought I'll you were going to make a belt. <laughs> really? <laughs> smooth. <laughs> So this is skiving, which is kind of a term for tapering, would you mm. say? Yeah, tapering, skiving the edge. We're just skiving back. Yep. Skive that Ooh, off. That is so thin. Look at that. So why did we actually do that? What? Well, that... what we we don't want a blocky edge. We ah, want it very yes. smooth. It's absolutely mesmerising watching Angus at work. It's not just his meticulous attention to detail. Slide our buckle on. This is ready to sew. It's the love and care he puts into everything he does. So would you like to have a go, Tara? I like the contrast of the colour as well. You've got that white stitch through there. It's nice. There we are, Tara. All done. Sewing done? Sewing's done. Just needs a quick run through the oil bath and then it's all yours. Here's your belt. Thank you very much for looking up Angus Barrett. I'm humbled. This is a beautiful thing and I'm going to absolutely love wearing it. Thank you. Can't guarantee I won't get paint on it, but I'm going to love it. Give it a flogging. Enjoy. It's been a pleasure to meet you. Thank, Thank you so you. much Thank for you sharing. Thank you very much. Gorgeous. And I like it.